Hundreds of people demonstrated on January 30th in front of the Israeli Prime Minister's office in Jerusalem. They were protesting the ongoing land grab happening in the Al Nakab or Negev Desert in southern Israel. They also demanded the legalization of unrecognized settlements there. <laughs> The protesters also demanded the release of all those protesters who were arrested in the last three weeks. Sunday's protest is one among many demonstrations that have been going on for more than three weeks now in the region. Protests have been happening against the Jewish National Fund's forestation initiative, which Palestinian Bedouins say is being staged to confiscate their land in the area. The JNF has been widely criticized as being a greenwashing tool for the Israeli government. Around 75% of JNF agricultural settlements and forests cover over 80 villages of pre-1948 Palestine. Right-wing Israeli groups have been forcibly planting trees on Bedouin land with the assistance of Israeli forces. The forces have been carrying out demolitions of Bedouin tents and destroying large swaths of land that the Bedouins have historically used for cultivation. An estimated 300,000 Arab citizens live in the Negev region. They live on 5% of their land, 95% of which they say was confiscated by Israel starting in 1948. The villages currently under attack are among 36 Palestinian Bedouin villages which are not officially recognized by the State of Israel. Similar demolition operations were also carried out in other Bedouin villages last month, during which Israeli forces destroyed crops and agricultural land. The non-recognition of these villages by the Israeli government means that they are constantly at risk of demolition and confiscation. This also bars them from receiving any kind of aid or assistance from the Israeli government in terms of infrastructure, electricity, water supply, roads, schools, healthcare, etc. Earlier attempts at similar displacement initiatives were consistently met with mass resistance and protests. Similarly, a demonstration was held in front of the Israeli municipality on January 30th against the ongoing demolition drive of Palestinian houses inside the city and in the Al-Nakab desert.